Hi, my name is Gustav Kappert, and I am going to demonstrate the PageRank um, assignment for CS50 AI. Um, what this basically does is it takes a list of web pages in a um, folder that link to each other or don't link to each other, have relationships with each other, um, and kind of tries to do a dumbed down version of the Google PageRank algorithm where it gives you the likelihood that you would land on any one of those particular sites. Um, obviously sites that are linked to more, you're more likely to land on. Sites that are linked to less, you're less likely to land on. Um, so um, it uses two approaches. One is a sort of random sampling method and the other is uh, an iterative method. Um, the random sampling method uh, basically puts you in the role or puts the computer in the role of like someone just choosing a page at random um, or really choosing a page kind of like based on the probability distributions from the last page. So assuming you were on page two, you follow a link um, and now you're on page three and what's the likelihood at page three that you're going to get to page four, page one. It's a little bit hard to explain without like drawing, um, but what it does is it ends up with 10,000 samples, each of which has its own probability distribution. And if you average all of those together, you're likely to get very close to the real probability distribution. Um, and the other approach is sort of the more mathematical iterative approach, um, which is what you would use to get the quote unquote real probability distribution to whatever degree of precision you want. Um, in this case, we're looking at like, I think 0 0.001. Um, so I'm just going to demonstrate that this works. Um, so I'm going to run page rank dat py, and I'm going to do it for each of these. Um, folders of web pages. So there's for that one. So you'll see like the sampling and iteration approaches um, produce very similar results. Um, do it again, again, very similar results from sampling and iteration. Um, if I go ahead and run that again, you'll see that uh, iteration produces exactly the same result and sampling um, kind of by its nature produces slightly different result um, from up tap. So here you get like 0 0.1148 and here you get 0 0.1128 um, but like you know that's a, it's a probably a pretty acceptable um, degree of error and then if you run it for the third folder um, once again you know you see very similar ones um, very similar values and if I run it again again you'll see that in iteration is always going to give you the same values um, and sampling is going to give you slightly different values um, if you had a much bigger data set, uh, a much bigger set of pages, um, sampling is going to be way the hell more efficient than iteration. Um, in this case, iteration, I think, is actually computationally a little bit better than sampling. Um, but this just kind of, I think, demonstrates like how you um, can get pretty good answers, um, or you can get good answers by sampling. Um, and if you actually wanted to make it more efficient um, than iteration, you could go ahead and like turn the samples down to 100. And if you did that, oh man, show terminal, more coffee needed. Okay. Um, if you did that, um, I think it should be saved. Then I'm going to run it again for the first one. And, you know, like once again, you get pretty good answers um, with 100 samples, um, pretty damn close to the, the real one. And same thing with, you know, if you'd run it for all of them. Um, so um, 10,000 might have been kind of overkill. Um, all right, that's uh, PageRank. Thank you.